What if all the ocean water turned into fresh water? Imagine the catastrophic consequences this would have on our planet. From the collapse of marine ecosystems, to drastic changes in global climate, and serious impacts on human health. In today's video, we will explore this intriguing hypothesis, and discuss how such a profound change could affect marine life, alter climate patterns, and challenge our very survival. Get ready to embark on a scientific journey that goes beyond the surface and helps us understand the critical importance of the oceans to life on Earth. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to follow this and other fascinating explorations that address the greatest mysteries of our planet. The conversion of all ocean water to fresh water would significantly impact global sea levels due to the density difference between salt water and fresh water. Salt water, which is denser due to dissolved salt content, occupies less volume than fresh water for the same mass. If the oceans suddenly became less dense, this would result in an increase in water volume, consequently raising sea levels. This rise would not only drastically alter coastlines around the world, but could also lead to the flooding of densely populated coastal areas, displacing millions of people and causing vast economic and social impacts. The rise in sea levels would bring multiple environmental and infrastructural challenges. Low-lying areas such as river deltas, islands and coastal plains would be the most vulnerable. These regions, often rich in biodiversity and with high population density, would face risks of permanent submersion or frequent flooding, affecting natural and human habitats. The destruction of coastal habitats like mangroves and salt marshes, crucial for storm protection and biodiversity, would be almost inevitable causing irreversible losses in terms of flora and fauna. Besides direct impacts on sea level, this transformation would also affect ocean currents and global climate patterns. Ocean currents, influenced by variations in water temperature and salinity, play a crucial role in regulating the world's climate. Destabilizing these currents could lead to more erratic and extreme weather, with some regions experiencing significant cooling and others warming. These abrupt changes would affect agriculture, water security, and human health on a global scale. The conversion of salt water to fresh water in the oceans would have significant implications for global public health due to the potential increase in waterborne diseases. The ocean's salinity naturally controls many pathogens and parasites that cannot survive in high salinity environments. With reduced salt levels, pathogens previously restricted to fresh or estuarine waters could find the vast stretches of fresh ocean water, a new and vast habitat. This would facilitate the spread of various diseases, some of which could become epidemics if not adequately controlled. This new scenario would increase the risks associated with consuming seafood and human contact with seawater. Diseases such as cholera, hepatitis A, and various protozoan infections could see an increase in frequency and geographical distribution. Coastal waters, often used for recreation and as a source of drinking water through desalination processes, would become potential contamination hotspots, requiring new treatment standards and health surveillance to ensure water safety. Moreover, the impact on aquatic ecosystems could have indirect consequences on human health. With the change in marine biodiversity and possible extinction of species that act as natural regulators of disease vectors, there would be an imbalance that could further facilitate pathogen spread. For instance, the reduction of natural predators could result in an increase in populations of small organisms and insects that are intermediate hosts or disease vectors. Transforming all ocean water into fresh water would bring significant changes to ocean currents, whose dynamics are partly dictated by salinity variations, known as thermohaline circulation. This circulation is crucial for the distribution of heat across the world's oceans, clearly influencing global climate. The reduction or absence of salinity in the water would result in lower density, potentially disrupting the delicate balance that keeps these currents in motion. Without these currents operating as usual, there would be a radical redistribution of global temperatures, which could result in extremely erratic climates in various parts of the world. These changes in ocean currents could, for example, weaken or stop the Gulf Stream, which is responsible for carrying warm waters from the Gulf of Mexico to the North Atlantic. This current plays a crucial role in moderating the climate of northwestern Europe, making it significantly milder than would be expected at that latitude. 
an alteration or stoppage of this current could result in much harsher winters in Europe, affecting agriculture, the economy, and the well-being of populations. Furthermore, the weakening of ocean currents could also impact the global carbon cycle. The oceans play a vital role in absorbing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, and currents help transport this carbon from ocean surfaces to the deep sea. Destabilizing these currents would reduce the ocean's effectiveness in sequestering carbon, potentially exacerbating the effects of climate change by allowing more greenhouse gases to remain in the atmosphere. Transforming seawater into fresh water would have catastrophic consequences for marine ecosystems, as salinity is a crucial component for the survival of many marine species. Corals, mollusks, crustaceans, and numerous fish species are adapted to the specific saline conditions of their habitats. Fresh water could destabilize these environments, leading to mass die-offs of organisms that depend on salinity, not only for osmotic regulation, but also for feeding, reproduction, and growth. Coral reefs would be particularly affected, as they depend on stable salinity to maintain their symbiosis with zooxanthellae, microscopic algae that provide essential nutrients to corals through photosynthesis. Reduced salinity could disrupt this symbiotic relationship, resulting in a phenomenon known as coral bleaching, which often leads to coral death. Coral reefs are vital not only as biodiversity habitats, but also as natural barriers protecting coastlines from erosion. Additionally, many marine fish and invertebrates have finely tuned body fluid regulation systems for ocean salinity. A shift to fresh water would disrupt these systems, causing severe or fatal physiological stress for these species. This would not only cause mass marine fauna die-offs, but also trigger a chain reaction in the ecosystem, affecting predators and prey and altering the entire marine food web. I hope this video has helped to clarify the immense implications that such a drastic change as the transformation of the oceans from salty to fresh would bring to our planet. Although it is a hypothetical scenario, thinking about these possibilities helps us understand how delicate the balance of marine ecosystems is and the vital importance of salinity for life as we know it. If you enjoyed this video and want to continue exploring incredible curiosities and fascinating scenarios about the universe, science, and our planet, don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and activate the notification bell to receive updates on new videos. Your participation is essential for us to continue bringing content that sparks curiosity and expands our knowledge.